What's up guys? I am outside Heirloom Taco in Jacksonville, Alabama. Uh, I got some new lights in and they are battery powered. So I wanted to test uh, shooting on location in a place where I couldn't get power. And I thought maybe sitting outside on this little patio eating a taco might be a cool shot to get. So uh, I'm gonna start setting stuff up. Got my equipment here and um, we'll get things rolling check it out so the new lights that i got are the gvm 1300d light panels i've got three of them they can run off of ac power or they can run off of batteries which is really helpful when you're shooting outside especially at night and you need that extra little bit of light i was actually surprised at how powerful they really are and I think they're going to come in handy with a lot of future photography and video shoots. Alright, so I haven't fully decided on my framing yet, but I'm using this as a backdrop. Um, Heirloom Tacos was nice enough to let me shoot out on the patio today. Um, I like this pink taco sign, so I'm going to play off that with the lights. These lights are RGB lights, so I can bring in some pink elements to it. And then you've got the, uh, the uh, floaty lights in the background there. So uh, let's uh, find a frame and see what we're going to do. All right, I couldn't wait to eat. So I'm going to take a couple quick bites of this delicious taco. Oh, it looks so good. Shrimp. All right, so I think I found my framing here with the camera. I'm shooting on a Canon T3i. Uh, I kind of like this look of having the pink taco sign in the background with the uh, floaty lights up above me. So I'm going to start setting up lights and we'll see, uh, see how it goes. Alright, I've got two of the lights right now. I'm going to set up one as a key light and then I'm going to set the other one up as kind of uh, motivated by this pink tacos light sign. So we'll see how it goes. I don't know if you can see the light that's off camera now, but that's going to be my key light. I've got a light over here that's going to be for the pink taco sign. And I'm probably going to try and uh, find some type of backlighting for myself. So let's see where our frame is. All right, so I've got my lights on right now. I've got my key light, which isn't really that strong. I've got it at 50%. It's daylight balanced over here. I've got my uh, backlight over there, and that's going to be tungsten balanced to kind of match the floaty lights over here. And then I've got my uh, pink RGB. I got the light over here, motivated by the tacos light sign. Uh, so let's see how that looks so far. Let's take a test shot. Alright, so I didn't really like how small I was in the framing. I'm probably going to readjust the lights, have myself in front of the, the fence here, and just uh, see how I like it like that. So I've got the lights off for right now. I just swapped the battery and the camera. One thing I noticed with the last framing I had is that the background looks very dark. I'm going to switch up my backlight and actually aim it towards the patio area. So we'll see how that looks. There we go. All 
think that's about as good as we're gonna get. And so I can show you guys the framing here. That's what we're looking at. All right, guys, thank you for checking this little video out. Um, contact me if you'd like to work with some photography or video projects, and I will see you guys next time.